And they're off, and lucky Cristal, the slowest to come from the stalls, and Rosalind has unseated Kieran Fallon on leaving the gate. So Rosalind and Kieran Fallon part company as the remainder go through the first furlong of the coronation stakes, and there doesn't appear to be any great pace early on, and perhaps on sufferance, my Titania finds herself in front and going freely to Ritzina in a yellow jacket who's close up, and then Jay Wonder with a pink cap. Lightning Thunder is towards the outer, circling the field with a nose back and Euro Charlene against the running rail. Back towards the mid division, Sandiva is covered up, and then less talk in Paris as now Jay Wonder moves through and adopts the front running role as they begin the climb towards halfway. So it's Jay Wonder by a little over a length to My Titania. Ritzina is wide of Euro Charlene, that pair shadowed by Lightning Thunder. Tapestry in the dark blue tucked away on the inside of Less Talk in Paris, and then back to Kayoshi. Radiator with a pink cap is last but one, and following that sluggish start, Lucky Cristal racing round in rear. They begin the swing for home, approaching the last three furlongs, and it's still a J Wonder by a shade over a length, stalked by My Titania. And then Ritzina, Lightning Thunder around the field from Euro Charlene. Tapestry going for a run up the inner. Sam Beaver angling for a position. And less talk in Paris away to the right and further right radiator driven from the rear. Now quickening on down towards the last furlong and a half and Ritzina comes through to challenge Jay Wonder. On the far side, Euro Charlene is getting a seam through in behind these by Tichana at the one place and it's Ritzina who strikes on deep inside the last furlong. Euro Charlene finally gets the gap up the inner. Less talk in Paris flying down the outside but Ritzina in front wins the coronation for Clyde Benton.